Okay, good morning class. It's the Friday before winter break. Today we're going to be doing inequalities in triangles. Learning something new before winter break? Yeah, we're learning Aww. something new. Yeah. But I'm not assigning homework unless you want. Raise your hand if you want homework. Okay, two hands. Majority rules. What? Put your hand down. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Raise your hand if you want homework. Uh. <laughs> I didn't know that would get that reaction. <laughs> I'm really just yelling into my sleeve. <laughs> <laughs> There's the reference to this guy. I like his long legs. Look at these. Okay, uh, before we start the lesson, let me know how you feel. Yay, math? Yay, Yay math! math. Can you just scream it, please? <laughs> Yay, math! Yay, Yay math! math! Yes! That's better. That's better. Okay, here comes the lesson. And it's based on one concept. All right, here we go, one concept. Please draw the following shape, the line with triangle on it like this. All right, I'll tell you what, I'm going to do it a little bigger. Oh, yeah, yeah, this is five. <laughs> If I, if I asked you to yell, yay, math, like during the lesson, would you do it too, unexpectedly? Yeah. yeah. Okay, cool. I'll you have see. a choice. You do. You do. <laughs> All right, here we go. Let's mark the angles. Let's say this is 30, and let's say this is 80. Okay, say so this is 30, and let's say this is 80. So what angle can we fill in, perhaps? Yes? We can fill in everything. All right, so what would we start with first? This would be 70. How'd you get it? Be more specific, please. At 80 plus 30. 110. Right, because all angles in a triangle equal what class? 180. 180, good. So that's 110 plus blank equals 180. So you said it's 70. Right. Right, so the supplementary angle to a 70 is 110 also, all right. Right, right, right. So let's leave it at this for now. Check it out. 110, 30, and 80. Anyone see a rule? Uh. Bad baby. Oh. <laughs> I like I like babies. I don't hit them. Yeah. The exterior angle equals the average swing base. That's right. That's exactly the rule. Okay. And that's like not something. It's called the exterior sum theory. You don't have to know what it's called, but it's simply that this exterior angle here, 110, is the same as the two. They're called remote angles. The two angles on the far side within the triangle. 110 is the same as these two added together. And that's it. Okay, any questions about that? No, not 70. Oh, yeah, good. Very good. Yeah, 70 and 30 here should equal 100 here. So it works on the other side too. So if we put 100 here, that's good. That's a nice little find. I wasn't planning on talking about that. Yeah, 70 and 30 is this 100. Okay, so can you do it with numbers, let's say? All right, one, two, three, four. Who can say the equation? Yes? Uh, three plus four equals one. Right, right. Angles three and four equal one. Three plus four equals one. Okay, let's put it into practice. I'll take this off. All right, and you can see the picture on your papers. It looks like this. Okay, here we go. Wait, three and four equal one? Yeah, three and four equal one from now. I'm sorry if I took that too fast. Rewind me. <laughs> okay. All right, let's look at all the angles now. They're asking all angles less than angle one. All angles less than angle one. So let's go ahead and do this together. Angle one is an exterior angle. So, by the rule we just did, angle one equals what plus what, for example. Maybe someone else, someone else? Yes? Two plus three. Two plus three, good. Angle one equals two plus three. So, 
would you say, if we're looking for all angles less than, now let's write it out so the little it looks clear, less than angle one, what would the list be? Angle, yeah? Angle two and three. Angle two, angle three. Any questions why? Because if angle one equals two plus three, then two is definitely less than angle one. And three is definitely less than angle one. Okay, what else? Yes? Uh, eight, six, all, all of them but nine, right? Okay, not necessarily six. We have to find triangles that fit that exterior sum. Nine and six. Not, we can't say nine, we can't say six. Those aren't the ones. Oh, all but nine and six. All but nine and six. Yeah, 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 let's put it to practice. Could you figure out that six is less than one? Or would you not be able to figure that out? No, we couldn't, because they're both of two, so we don't know exactly. So let's look at it. One equals five plus what? Four. four. Not just four. Four plus two. Yeah, yeah. One <laughs> equals five plus four plus two. Uh, Do you so see this triangle? I'll outline in a red. This triangle goes like is that one here? So it's five plus four plus two. Equals one. Yeah. Cool. You'll be able to, you'll have to do that stuff in quizzes, alright? If you see that now, that's great news. Yes? Wouldn't that mean that angle 6 is the same as angle 1? No, not necessarily. Only if this is equilateral or isosceles. Okay, that's a good question. Yes? Um, we found the angles less than angle 1. Did you find it visually just by looking at it? Visually based on the rule that we did before, yeah. All right, so are you in agreement that 1, judging by the red triangle, 1 is the same as 5 plus 2 plus 4? Uh, sort of. Sort of, okay. I'll redraw it here. Here is one, and this is the red triangle. You see it? What angle is here? Five. Five. And here, there's two angles. There's two plus four, right? But we're not going to regard this line. We're not going to think about this line because we're thinking about this massive triangle here, and that's two and four together. So that's why. One equals five plus two plus four. Angle four, five. What else? is less than angle one. Any more? Less than angle one? Biggest triangle? Seven, eight. Seven and eight. Seven and eight. Yeah, right. so seven, eight. And seven. Seven. Does that can be in the video? Like, yeah, why not? Like, yeah, why not? I saw another awesome. video that that happened. Yeah, we did that. There's technical difficulties are fun. It's live programming. But you guys aren't afraid of a little adventure, are you? No. 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 Yeah. Okay, angle nine. All angles less than angle nine. Let's go through them. What's less than angle nine? Two, three, four, five, six. Eight, seven, Not three. Four, five, can't say less three. Less than angle nine. Less than nine. Okay. Less than angle nine, we have eight. What else? It's everything but seven. three and one. It's everything, yeah. Seven. Three and one. Yeah. Well, no, three is less because it's a right angle. Uh, well, we can't. Okay, so we all, so definitely we can say eight and three. Can we say six? Can we say six? No, we don't know. We can say six actually. No, no. three's not a right angle. You drew it. Faulty. We can say six. That's a faulty drawing. Wait, how can you say? Six? Oh yeah, because because six, six is six the, and seven the, like the opposite one. Yes, yeah, so six and seven are opposite. You can say three. You can say three. You can say nine. three. Yeah, you can say angle three because it's within the triangle. That's right. You can say four. You can say two. Five. You know five? You're wrong. Five is also. That's right. Because basically nine is going to be more. The further out you get from the center of the triangle, the bigger the angle gets. So five is also one. Angle five, right? Okay. And now all angles greater than five? One and nine. All angles greater than five is one and nine. 
Nine. Six. That's right. Six. Please. Six. Three. Three. That's right. Three is the same as four and five. That's right. And then all angles greater than eight. What's greater than eight? Nine. Six. Nine, Nine is. Nine. Six. Six is greater than eight. One. One. Five is greater than eight. Three. Three. One. Three is greater than eight. One's greater than eight because one is the same as eight plus two, four, and seven. Any questions about how we're doing this? Yeah, we did it. We switched to verbal. Yeah. Okay. And it also works, you guys. We're going to do the last one. It also works with sides. Yesterday we mentioned that the bigger the angle, the bigger the side opposite. So we're going to demonstrate that now. I can draw this Picasso. All right, here we go. We have that one here, here, A, B, C, D. So judging by this picture, let's look at triangle ABD. Triangle ABD. What is the smallest angle in triangle ABD? Yes. Angle D. Right. Can you say it though in th with three letter format? Because I don't know what you mean. Angle BDA. Yeah. Yeah. The smallest one here. So we could put small. What is the next? Smallest angle. No. In this triangle here. Yes, please. Um, angle um, BDC. BDC. I'm talking about this triangle only. Oh. You want to try again? ABD. ABD. So this one. That's no, good. no, no, no. A B A D. Yeah, B A D. Bad. Bad to the bone. Medium. Uh, and then how the, can you tell? How can you tell? It's opposite the medium side. This is the smallest angle, because it's opposite 23, which is the smallest side. This is the medium angle, because it's across from 35. And thus, this one's opposite 39, so it's the biggest one. Okay, and now for this triangle here, last one. Yeah, please. Let's. Yeah. The smallest one is angle ABC. Yeah. Angle ABC. Yeah. B D C. This one. Yes. So this one's a small one. Next. Someone else. Yeah. Um, angle BC is the medium one. B, C, D. No, that's not the medium one. C, D. Yeah. Where's the medium one? This one or this one? Isn't it across? Across from what? Oh, you're right, you're right. Yeah, I'm looking. Yeah, I got turned around. You're right. Medium. That's right. My paper's on this one. Yeah, yeah. And then yeah. Vindicated. Okay. You were down something where like you know it's right, you think it's right, so you write it down, and then he says it's right. So right, right, right. And then you say it's wrong, so you erase it. And that we were talking about symbolism. Writing down the f the false angle symbolizes experience, and experiences are like waterfalls flowing <laughs> through the streams of life and the canals, and the bird. <laughs> Okay, thanks guys. Do you still have energy? No. No? What happened? You got tired? You got tired? Okay, so then uh, give me a halfway decent yay math. Yay math? Yay math! <laughs> 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 Eight plus seven. That's not that one. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs>
you like that? Where's my blue? Oh, here it is. No, it's 